Hey folks, welcome back to Let's Play Lightning Returns, Final Fantasy XIII. I'm Sirius JG. We froze time and then hopped on the train, so I don't know if time will be unfrozen again immediately. There wasn't a whole lot for us to do with this last bit of time in the day. And indeed, time unfroze immediately, so that was a waste uh, of chronostasis, probably. Standing around doing nothing. Alright, so I'm trying to get down to the slaughterhouse, but I don't even know if uh it might be too late in the uh in the night to even work there. And I've certainly lost uh all of my powers to Late December back in sixty-three. Something, 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 what a night. Yeah, it might actually be too late to even do this quest. I know you the lists are closed, the sand's already soaked with blood. Come back tomorrow. So this is a complete waste of a trip. Um... I don't even know if we can get anywhere useful before the day's over. If there is some quest to do with those guides, I never quite came across it. What do you got to say? Okay. I'm glad you're just willing to volunteer that to anyone. Anyone who comes along, he's like, Let me tell you about my deepest fear. I sentence you to be exposed before your peers. Tear down the wall. Sorry. <clears throat> got, got up there. Ah, go kill a couple hoplites. Shit, I didn't think that's what we would... I, I... It kind of occurred to me after... A, after I activated Chrono Stasis. It's almost time to transport you back to the ark. This is a completely wasted trip. We didn't really have anything that useful to do back in Use Nine anyway, but who knows? Maybe you who's hanging around here 24 7. None of us are interested in you. Okay, well, I'm not interested in you either. I just thought maybe you would have, like, rewards that have picked up KS seeds and not realized that. At least I can fight one of these guys. Too much about these non elemental blasts, does he? Okay, let's do this. Nice, bounce you. Alright, so we have a basically meaningless trip to use non here, but I got a silver milestone. That's not a bad reward, I guess, considering the level of effort. The drops from enemies do change as you get later into the days. I don't know what you do with, uh... I don't know if you can encounter hoplites there. I know you can get encounter them over here. I also know that extinguishing the hoplites is really not that big of a deal. We are going to, um... It's going to take us, like, ten seconds to kill the super hop... The hoplite omega is not going to be a major threat. Because hoplites aren't a threat at all. What's your most valuable treasure? <laughs> You're so eager to die. 
These guys are kind of tanky. Not that exciting or fun to fight either, they're just kind of a pain. I'll bring back lost time. But he's dropping stuff. It's dropping stuff, they're dropping stuff. Here's ES dropping stuff. We're getting liquid glass out of them. That no it's liquid glass I don't care about. Silver malastones are kind of I mean, they're a consumable resource that it's nice to have more of, I guess. I don't even know why I'm bothering to make the trip. We are not getting to where Hoplite spawned in time. And again, it's not that big a deal to do. It's just like when there's when there's nothing else to do. Yeah, but it's not like I can go back early, so why are you... Whatever. They're giving you these little reminders that you're about to run out of time, so you can plan. That's fine. Got stuck void. standing on his head. Keep up. This is probably the best way to stagger it, you think, right? Yeah. This heavy slice is doing a lot better when it's uh We we'll give you clubbing. A lot of the ruin spell. That's the thing. Ooh, ruin level two and a ruin guy and a liquid glass and building up tiny, tiny, tiny amounts of VP that aren't going to matter. Wait, is there something hidden over here? No, that's just a fixture of the background. Okay. Keep getting turned around. I keep getting confused about how to proceed here. It's nearly six. Don't be alarmed when the teleportation process starts. It can be quite sudden. It can be quite sudden. I mean, it's works the same way every time, right? Pretty super exciting. If we got to fight one hoplite before this all disappears. Hoplites. Pierre, you are not a hoplite. The light of your soul is mine. Totally into soul lights, so. Way of finding hoplites. I'm so close, I can practically taste those hoplites! No! The eighth day is over, it's time to return to the Ark. But yeah, we're really, like, seriously running out of stuff I can still do. And the plot is very close to resolving. And I've already kind of decided. Like, I'd never beaten the super bosses on this game before. Uh, before Let's Playing it, I hadn't beaten the super bosses on the other uh, Final Fantasy XIII games either. But I'm already getting ahead of, like, I'm going to give it a fair shot. But this is not a game where, like, I can grind and do stuff to really get stronger. Like, if I am just completely outclassed. Like, it's obvious I can't hang long enough to even develop a strategy. I am willing to just let this go. And at this point, we're just seeing as much of the content as we can and hoping it's enough to get us strong enough to fight Grand super the bosses. World, the main story? Me. I think we got it. On the last day of the world, certain things are going to go down and lightning will be involved. Day 9, four days to the end. We've got plenty of time. 
That's why I feel bad that we've permanently broken some of the quests. We got more than enough time to do them if you well, read sequence things that better. Time, again. time to bake the donuts, light. We got Heart Stealer. Okay, let's see what this is about. Feud with the soul of the thief allows for quick and natural attacks and hastens the recover of ATB. ATB speed increases ATB speed by 35 and stagger capability by 5. That sounds pretty good. Leaping Rush unleashes a physical attack that it launches enemies into the air, not very likely to make enemies recoil. Okay, it's just a weak uh, physical attack. Which doesn't seem that impressive. And then Evade is. Meh. So there you go. It's. It's. This is. It comes with, like, high ATB, but it's also got, like, built-in two abilities, which are not that great. So. Okay. I'm just kind of thinking we might get a little scene with, um, what's her name? Evil Sarah. Uh, whatever her thing was. I forget. Lumina. So Vanille seems well. I'm glad. I remember her, you know, from way back when. Yeah, you had a crush on her. Didn't I make fun of you over that? Let's talk to Hope about Lumina. I met Lumina again. You mean the girl who walks in the chaos? That no, her name's the Lumina. Don't get I picked up in the ark. She brings the chaos with her. Like, there's something that bothers me about that girl. Perhaps you've noticed it as well. You mean the you fact mean that she looks exactly like Sarah? Like Sarah at that yeah, age? what the hell? So you think so too. They're so alike. I can't help thinking that it really is her in some way. She may look like Sarah, but it's not her. Lumina's just too different. And she- Sarah almost never brought chaos with her wherever she walked. Really rubs me the wrong way. Maybe she's not that bad. Just that her behavior seems all the worse when she looks so much like your sister. In any case. No, I think she's pretty much like appearing and disappearing magically and taunting us about our failure to save souls. It seems kind of a dick move. She- she- she kind of helped us with Zaz, though. Like, in a kind of mocking way. But, yeah, she gave us what was needed to save Zaz, ultimately, so... For now, Lumina's real identity will remain a mystery. All we can say for sure is you and her don't get along. Uh-huh. About Zero One, I guess we're not getting anything more on this. What do you think Fang is going to do now? Will she try to Whatever break into the wants. Order's cathedral and stop the ceremony? Yes. Holy tree stands silently. Yeah, it's we've we've got as much time as we can. Like we've at this point I've you can unlock a certain number of extra days. I believe we've already managed to make sure we have as many days as possible. Uh New items are available for Burgess. So you've now got X Potion, Re-Raise Potion, which a small amount of HP and cast Re-Raise to prevent KO once. Oh, that's kind of a neat one. I don't imagine we can get it any way other than here. Regen, Holy Water, Protect and Shell. Yeah, re-raise seems nice, but I don't know exactly what it would do and why it would be better than Phoenix Down, honestly. Um, so we'll just get out of here. I guess I'll throw it on a safe while we're here in case I change my mind after we've gotten down to the world. But, um... I don't think I will. I suppose while I'm here, I could um, refight something that I did a 
yeah, on screen, I did a terrible job against the giant. Uh, what are they called? Reaver. I don't remember what its weakness is, though. Let me fight the Reaver real quick and just try to do a better job. I don't think I've done that on camera. I had that video where we did really poorly against it, so let's uh, see if we can do better. It's weak against ice and lightning. Takes half damage from wind, so we actually don't want Araga. It's the only thing I've got equipped that would be terrible against it. I guess I should, uh... To me, to stop, and nothing else. Um... Yeah, ice and lightning, okay. Spark strike error. So we change error to with Thundaga level three. Aurora level 23, 21 attack cost, 1.56 damage. Thundaga... Oh, it would have to be Thundara to be the same. And I don't have a gold Thundara. Thundaga is more expensive. Hmm. I got a nice um, fire and ice spell. Doo -doo -doo. Do Blizzard or Blizzard level two? All right, let's see what we can do. And of course, I know if I just waste uh, all the EPs, we can just shred anything uh, at this point. We killed Gaius in less than a minute. Um, That's, I think that's what I did uh, off screen. But it wasn't using its final base really stats or whatever. Okay, I, I don't think I did this quite right. So he's going to get back up. You're supposed to be able to if you really know what you're doing. You can do it to where he never gets uh, to this stage. I guess it's blocking his attacks that really staggers him more than doing your own damage, does he? Yeah, because this is taking forever. I'm not doing it right. I haven't done this one in a while, I guess. Hit I shouldn't have taken. Yeah, you're supposed to double stagger on that.
Try to keep up. Yeah, I'm kind of making a mess of this, aren't I? I just figured I might as well waste everything since that's the road I was going down. <sighs> well, okay. Felt like it was taking forever, but once you're just wasting, uh, you can, yeah, your chronostasis, you can pretty much get to five stars with whatever. Anything else we want to fight while we're here? No. Let's <laughs> take a minute and just beat the shit out of Noel. I don't even know, um, I don't even know what, um, we didn't get his weaknesses set up or anything. It's just beat shit out of him. Come true. You think you have to kill me? That's, that feels more like what Lightning versus uh, Null should have been. 25 seconds is wailing on the priests. Okay. They're different. The uh, There's like different versions you fight on different days. So I guess with the Omegas, somebody told me in the comments, their stats increase on the final day. So if you beat them early, when you fight them in the rematch mode here, you end up facing them with higher stats. But these guys, it's literally a different enemy. So we're fighting the early game snow. And I really should be using um, fire as his weakness, but I don't think it's going to be. Come get me! Wow, this is actually, he's giving us a bit more fight than Noel does. Oh, I didn't mean to do Army of One, but... It's not terrible, it's just... Well, look at how little damage is there. Oh, that's because of it. It's based on the stats of that outfit, which is... Anyway, yeah, you uh, stagger them and start overclocking. They really don't have much of a chance to do anything. It lasted longer than Noel did, though. I'm just a little curious. Grendel. I wouldn't have Fang's help, though, so it would be a very different fight. Okay, well, we're not doing it right now. We are going to... I think we need to head for... Uh... Luxarian South Station. We've got some... Hmm. I really do need to have a FAC out for this. We've got a couple of people that we need to go looking for that appear at, like, certain times of day. Uh, and I don't have the thing in front of me that tells me exactly when they do appear. But I know that, um, I can get that going between videos here. I also know that we can look at our Canvas of Prayers quests. This is a 7 p.m. quest, so this is like an early, early at night quest. This is research camp. This is a book that records a prophecy that's been kept secret for many centuries. So we got at least two things to find in the wildlands, and then something that we can find in the dead dunes.
Chocoborel. We need Chocoborel. Grashell greens, Tantile greens, Silkus greens. I don't know how to find some of this stuff. Very unusual recipe. Rocky Crag Mold, Chocoborel, Luminous Mushrooms. I need to make Chocoborel. I need Day Ring Blossoms. Yeah, I just need to make a whole bunch of Chocoborel. This one, I might have given away the only mystical meal we can ever get. Um, I might have given that one away. I might have given that one away forever. I don't know if there's a way to get another one. Uh, what is the recipe for Chocoborel? Will you just tell me here? Chocobo Chow. <coughs> no. Well, we could just go grab those two global quests. Um, oh, because one of these is just go straight to the research camp. That's handy. Give us something to do that isn't sensitive to a certain time of day. Because to finish this quest with uh, Steve Bloom, I'm going to have to keep encountering this weird uh, ex-reporter who only appears at certain times of day. So hopefully I've got enough days left to do that. I may have uh, made a mess of that. I may it be that you need to initiate that real early to have enough time. So basically I'm just walking around, exploring the corners of this place for where there might be a glowing that you can examine that is not we still call ourselves a research team wait don't tell me you want me to make more medicine you're going to have to pay okay animal potion I don't care about this one I don't have a quest that requires it I, I want to do the magnificent meal Oh, fashion photo frame. Okay. Well, there you go. That was one of the quests. What's your deal? You still seem to have a quest. Huh. So, you're growing tan tall greens, are you? I figured a Philistine like you would be growing tan tall greens. Go to hell. <laughs> Sorry. All right, I'm going to call it a, qu a video here. When we come back next time, we'll deal more with this guy. Who wants us to go to hell? See you then.